Good early morning. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlogs. Yeah. If you enjoy this video, make sure you come back every day. Happy birthday! Thank you. We woke up and then I fell back asleep on the couch. It's been really cozy. <laughs> yeah, this window's cracked right here and it's like rainy coolness basking in Sarah's head. Hey, stay away from that candle. I'm 30. You're 30. Ooh. I went to go get garbage out this morning before we have birthday breakfast cake, or in this case, pie. And Sarah got a Jerry Summons on her birthday. On my birthday, I've been served. Jerry Summons. <laughs> Look at my hair. I fixed my hair. Yep. Get someone for a jury duty. Happy birthday to me. Look at this hair. All right, so for anybody who hasn't followed along our past couple birthdays, we do something very intentional for breakfast, and that is having our cake or pie, whatever we would plan to have after dinner on birthday night for breakfast. So Sarah wanted a Dutch apple pie. We picked it up yesterday. We're having that for breakfast. And we always use our um, cake cutting set that Sarah and I got for our wedding. What is it? Mackenzie Child. We use this, this is what we used to cut our, our wedding cake um, when we got married. And uh, we use that to cut our cake and pie. So I'm gonna dish up some pieces of this Dutch apple pie for Sarah, James, and I to enjoy. And here we have it. Start to a good day. It's gonna be cool today and chilly and rainy, but we're gonna have a good birthday. stopped raining. It's still in the 50s, but it's actually going to get a little bit warmer into the evening. Our plan has evolved. We, well, I mean, it really went from nothing to something. And um, that is we're going to go to the Cubs game, even if it's just for a little bit. Um, but first, my sisters gave me a manicure and pedicure for my birthday. So I'm going to get that done. And then I'll be all fresh for when the baby arrives. I think someone's awake after a three and a half hour nap. <gasps> Hi, Jamesy. Did you have a good long nap? Yeah. Do you wanna go play? I'm done working now. Yeah. You love hanging out in the window? This hair, oh my gosh. You have to get it fixed before the wedding, Jamesy. Hello. You were napping for so long. Do you like my pretty nails? He's got the classic on, so he cannot be disturbed. But we do have to get my own Yay! Who is ready for the game? We got a jersey. We got a jacket and we have upgraded seats tonight. Alright, so birthday girl came back from getting her nails done. Which we already showed. There a while. Okay. Yeah, you were. But like they James was asleep. To like induce labor on the heat. Exotic. <laughs> um, so we're going to the Cubs game. We already had tickets, but I reached out to our ticket rep to be like, hey, um, is there it's, a, a it's, it's a special day. It's Sarah's birthday. It's her due day. We will probably bring Teddy to a Cubs game fairly young, like how we brought James to the boardwalk at six days old and Magic Kingdom at ten days old. But we just, like, we won't know until we know. What if, for some reason, Teddy has to be in the NICU? What if Sarah has to be in the hospital for two weeks? So it was just kind of like, hey, is there anything special going or anything special we can do? And our ticket rep called me today and was like, hey, I can upgrade your seats to, like, a better section today. 
So I look, we looked it up on like a, a seat view. Yeah, like view from my seat. And we're like just behind, one section behind to the left of home plate. Oh, um, nice. So it should be good. So we were gonna just like stay home even though we had the tickets. But like with this little upgrade, like even if we're there for a couple of innings, we're gonna have dinner at the ballpark. It'll be yeah. a nice little. Right, it's it's literally like if anything, it's how the doctor wants Sarah to get one or two miles of a walk-in. That's what at a minimum, it's like walking almost a mile, taking however long of a break we want in Wrigley Field, and then walking almost a mile home. So, if anything, it's what the doctor ordered, and really nice that our ticket rep was able to do that. Yeah, no, it's great. But, I mean, it's just, I used to always go to Cubs games for my birthday. So. Oh. Have fun. One time, my daddy. So our ticket rep came over and gave us a onesie for Teddy and James's first pack of baseball cards. Woo! Got Moana. Top of the third. It's one to one. They're showing you the hearts. Oh, those are nice. All right, here's dinner, or at least first dinner. We got an Italian beef with hot. We got Italian sausage with sweet and some chips. James, you got a free Gatorade. Magical moment. Ooh. And house made chips. And we can't leave a seat because. And a 3 1 2, yeah. We can the seats because then the Cubs get a score, a run scored against them. Stealing pickles from Wrigley Field. On <laughs> in honor of being at the Cubs game tonight, and in honor of Sarah's birthday, we are. In honor of Peter looking like Matthew Broderick. Hey. We're watching one of Sarah's top three favorite movies of all time. We should go to that house. We already did. That? Didn't we? We did. We went to the Hummel house. Oh, uh, they're like the same thing. This is true, every day. Peter is putting James down, and I just want to show you the super cute onesie that our season ticket rep gave us for Teddy, Rookie of the Year. So stinking cute. We did it. We almost called it before we even had a chance and said, let's just have him come into bed with us because we were pooped. And we weren't feeling it. We were like, no. We're gonna do it, we're gonna give it a shot. And he was great. He went right down. I don't know why I'm exhausted. I'm not due to have a baby today. Classic scene, classic scene. Say, is that my big old ice water right there? What? Is that my old white ice water right there? Yeah. You are my best friend. Bless his little heart. He ain't there, mom. He's out gallivanting around the city like a hooligan. Um, sorry, but the house was built on a sound stage in LA. I guess we really did go to the Home Alone house then. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, there was an actual house that is in LA too. So there's a sound stage house and there's the outside of the house neighborhood. And they had to like cover up eucalyptus because it's supposed to be in like a northern suburb of Chicago. <laughs> Aren't we lucky to have such a good guard dog? Uh -huh. Time to sign off. 
May 18th, leaders inspire themselves and others to do, be, give, and become more than they ever thought possible. Tony Robbins. All right, I'm officially past our due date. And so we're being patient and it's good to be home. Thank you for all the, the birthday messages today. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.